Web development moves fast. Next AES for the front fast API. Five tones. Here's the best practice. This is the developer show. Hey everyone. As you can tell, this is a special episode. I'm currently in Maryland, USA for NZConf 2025. NZConf is the biggest Angular conference in the world and this year is happening right here on the East Coast at the Hyatt Regency Chesapeake Bay. The venue is absolutely stunning, surrounded by nature, right by the water. There is this cold energy everywhere, the bay on the side, forest trails on the other and yes, even a few deer wandering around the mornings. The hotel has everything a gym overlooking the swimming pool, huge outdoor spaces, and plenty of spots to relax or code with a view. It's the perfect setting for a mix of learning, inspiration, and a little downtime. So before diving into all the Angular updates, let's start from the beginning. I landed at Dulles Airport in Washington DC and had to drive through the city all the way to Chesapeake Bay. It's about a two-hour drive, and honestly not a bad one when you get to pass right through the heart of Washington. I couldn't resist a short stop downtown, passed by the Capitol, the White House, and some of those iconic DC streets. Then I drove straight to the hotel to get some rest before the conference kicked off. This is my second NZConf. The first one was back in 2023 in Utah, and it's amazing to see how much has grown since then. The hotel sits right by the water, with incredible views and peaceful surroundings. It's honestly the perfect place to mix learning and a bit of relaxation. In the mornings, I went for a run in the surrounding area something I try to do at every conference. It's the best way to clear my mind before a full day of sessions. The views were unreal and the fresh air helped reset before diving into Angular. Once things got going, the sponsor area was buzzing. NX, Hero Devs, Microsoft, Vanguard, Meshus and plenty more. Stickers, swag, coffee and of course endless conversations about performance, signals and what's next for Angular. The Angular team kicked things off with the keynote and Angular 21 looks like one of the most exciting releases yet. Here are some of the biggest updates announced in version 21. We get signal forms, making forms reactive and type safe. We get zoneless Angular, simplifying change detection and improving performance. We also get better type safety. Now we can use the keyword as in control flow conditionals and type checked host bindings. Finally, we get many new DevTools enhancements. We now have signal visualization and root insights, as well as performance profiling in the browser DevTools. The focus this year really feels like policy, making Angular faster, simpler, and more developer-friendly. Of course, there were also tons of sessions covering other topics, from advanced state management and use cases with signals, to testing and scalable architectures. And a big theme this year was AI, how to efficiently use large language models to enhance Angular applications, shape instruction files for best practices, and automate parts of the development process. It's exciting to see how AI is becoming part of the modern development workflow. Between talks, there were plenty of chances to connect. Lunch, spontaneous discussions about signals and state management, and meeting developers from all over the world. And then, after the talks, the fun part. In the evening, besides dinner, there was a virtual golf session, karaoke, and even a series of pirate-themed games. It was the perfect mix of having fun and connecting with the Angular community. It was two days full of Angular, incredible people, and a location that made it all even better. Huge thanks to the organizers, speakers, and everyone who made NZConf 2025 such a memorable experience. I have included the most interesting resources and links from the conference in the description of this video, so don't forget to check it out. And if you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to subscribe either because more episodes and dev stories are on the way. This is the Developer Show from NZConf 2025.